Welcome back to WCW Worldwide Wrestling. Tony Schiavone, Bobby the Brain Heenan. The home of Worldwide is the Disney MGM Studios and the arena here at the studios called the Worldwide Arena. As you look, it is the hottest ticket at the MGM Studios. Everybody wants to be a part of World Championship Wrestling. I'm leaving right from here to Baltimore. How about you? Yes, I am. Can we travel together? Well, no, I'm sorry. You pay for the gap. See, there you go. I like to go in a limo. I know you do, and you do not allow me to go in your limos, but that's the way that's you... because you don't tip. It's your limousine. Tony, you both can't tip. We'll spoil them. <laughs> All right. Faces of Fear making their way in. They're already in the ring, and here comes Harlem Heat. Take you back a week ago, Brain. If we all recall what happened in the triangle match, it was Public Enemy, Harlem Heat, Faces of Fear. Public Enemy got the win, but Harlem Heat clipping the legs of the Faces of Fear, causing the win, leading to a lot of animosity between these two teams, and thus, one of these main events in the double main event this week, Harlem Heat, Faces of Fear. Well, if you're talking about that triangle match, I don't remember a whole lot about it. I remember six bodies flying around constantly for about a half hour, a bunch of people got their hand raised, a bunch of people carried out, a bunch of people still yelling and swearing and fighting. And this is what we come up with. Harlem Heat and the face of the fear. And who won that? Public Enemy? Public Enemy. Brain, you were there with me last week. You can't remember week two. You're so... I have savage on my mind. That's what I was getting ready to say. You are so distraught. You are so shaken up about this Macho Man Randy Savage thing. So, I tell you what, don't show up. Just say, hey, I'm busy. Well, now, well, there, there's something else I don't think you're aware of, but... Uh, what's, what's that? Go ahead, you can tell me. I what? don't want to let Flair down. You don't want to let Flair down? That's the whole problem. It, I, I don't want him and Arn, I don't want to let him down. Yeah. Otherwise, right. I just say, hey, you know and I know what's going on. What? It's the money. There's Lit no money changed hands. This is done free gratis. Oh, you... W wait a minute. I'm talking to Bobby the Brain Heenan. You're getting paid for your services. And you're probably getting paid with the Macho Man's money. What are you getting paid? How many zeros? I'm, one zero. Nothing. Nothing. I'm doing this out of the kindness of my heart. How much? A million? No, Flair wouldn't give me a million. I asked. A hundred thousand? I, mean, well, I, did, I didn't. A hundred thousand dollars? How'd you? No. A hundred thousand dollars? No, don't there could be some tax guy listening. <laughs> Get a hundred thousand dollars in deferred payments. Well, in deferred payments. Huh? I said I, I, if I was, if I got a hundred, it would have been in deferred. I didn't get it. Oh, quit trying to put tax words in my mouth or something. A, a knee to the uh, uh, chest. In and oh, spin wheel kick. That was nicely done. Now, do you think if I asked Rick nicely and just said to him and our hey, you know, it's my cat's birthday. I got to be home that day or <laughs> yeah. something. You know, I'll, I'll take the money. I'll stay home. We'll no, you can have. That. You can. Uh, but you I, can have the money. I, right? No, you can have whatever you think you want to offer me, but keep it. I just. It's Macho Man's money anyway, because I know that you wouldn't do it for free. Oh, no, and I know oh, no, Flair, no, 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 And I no. know Flair wouldn't pay you with his own money. That so means there. Macho Man's thinking I'm getting paid with his money. Boy, you're a dead man. Yes, you are. Dead man walking. <laughs> dead man walking. Meanwhile, Faces of Fear and Harlem Heat just battling back and forth. Two of the most powerful, four of the strongest men in our sport, Brain. Brain, you're white. <laughs> you're white. Your face is ashen. Tony, um, this man thinks this man is going to think I'm I'm ripping him off. I'm all right, Heenan, you take a second. You compose yourself. Let me jump in here and talk about what's coming up as far as the Great American Bash on Sunday. If you have not made arrangements to get it online, you call now. It's only on pay-per-view. But then, New York, get ready for Sunday, June 30th, as the Great American Bash Tour 96 rolls right into the theater at Madison Square Garden. That is Sunday, June 30th. Your tickets are waiting for you at the Garden Box Office and all Ticketmaster outlets. Keenan, you still seem a little nervous here, pal. I, um... You're stumbling I, again. I wonder... Now, you asked me this, Tony. What, what, if I, what if I told Savage? I'll make a deal with you. I'll stay on my side of the ring. You stay on yours. I will not interfere in the match. I will give nothing but verbal advice and cheerleading. Well, I'm sure since you've been a man of your word for so many years in this sport, he'd go for that. <laughs> That's not funny, Tony. <laughs> That's not yeah, funny. Uh, that's kind of to me. There's parts of me at stake here. Yes, there's going to be parts of you all over the Inner Harbor, as a matter of fact. Possibly. I just, just a feeling there. And here comes the Barbarian. Brain, 
Next week at this time, everything will be fine. I'll send you flowers. Up on top, both men. It's kind of you, Tony. Yeah, you're welcome. Do me a lot of good one taking a dirt nap. <laughs> Down goes Booker T of Harlem Heat. Lateral press one, two. Can we get Brain a cup of water? Yeah, here that's going to be nice. You can send me flowers at the hospital in Baltimore while my nostrils are in Des Moines, right? <laughs> Uh, I was I'm thinking, sure we're making light of something no, here because of no, you, and I'm you're not, I'm getting sorry. amused at the fact that I'm going to be three feet high pretty soon, and my ears will be in my pockets. Listen, I, I'm having a good time because I know that there's there's a possibility of some peril for you, but I know you're going to have a plan. You wouldn't go in anything like this if you didn't know that the deck was the deck was stacked in your favor some way. Well, at least you would tell me what you know that I wish I knew. If I could stack the neck, uh, you can stack the diamond deck. If you forget it again, Savage, I'd be glad to do that. Sit down here, here. S sit down that chair. There you go. I am sitting. <laughs> you just fell on the floor. A clothesline. Boy, we can't wait till Baltimore. I can. <laughs> it's going to be exciting this, this Sunday, and we've got all four going at it. Are you on the late evening flight tonight? Uh, yes, I am. I'm walking. <laughs> all four going at it. Randy Eller is calling for the bell. This one's been thrown out. we got a double disqualification here, Brain. I should be there on Halloween Havoc time. <laughs> Oh, my goodness. Of course there's going to be a disqualification. I never saw you could control these four anyway. They went to see all week. They've been waiting to get their hands on each other. And now they have it. Let him go, ref. Let him go. The fight continues here on WCW Worldwide Wrestling. Don't worry about stopping them. Stop the Macho Man. Or now is it Mad Dog Savage? We invite you to listen to this, fans.